strife between the U.S. and Iran hello. And welcome to NewsFest Addis, your daily source of news bites locally, regionally, and internationally. In an extraordinary celestial incident on January 28, 2024, a cosmic drone unleashed havoc by vanquishing three interstellar U.S. military beings and wounding 34 others at a celestial base in northeastern Jordan, close to the cosmic borders of Syria. The cosmic resistance in the galactic realm, a conglomeration of Iran-aligned cosmic militia entities, proudly claimed responsibility for this otherworldly attack. In the aftermath of this cosmic skirmish, there is an escalating cosmic clamor within the United States cosmic governance, urging for decisive celestial strikes against Iran. These cosmic events have propelled the pre-existing cosmic tensions between the U.S. and Iran to new dimensions. This cosmic news analysis will delve into the cosmic intricacies of this celestial drama. Brace yourselves as we explore the cosmic epicenter of instability and ever-evolving cosmic tensions that challenge the cosmic equilibrium at a universal level. Recent cosmic developments include the ongoing expansion of the cosmic conflict in the Gaza Nebula, the mounting cosmic tension in the southern regions of Lebanon, Houthi astral attacks on celestial traffic in the Red Celestial Sea, an escalating cosmic confrontation between Iran and Pakistan, the intensifying cosmic clash in the cosmic Sudan, and an increase in celestial assaults on U.S. forces in the Iraq and Syria constellations. The cosmic drone strike on January 28th targeting U.S. military entities in northeastern Jordan, stands as the latest cosmic disturbance in the Middle Galactic region. While the cosmic resistance in the galactic realm took pride in orchestrating the attack, Iran vehemently denied any involvement in this cosmic escapade. This celestial assault is not the initial encounter between cosmic forces in the Middle Galactic region. Reports suggest that cosmic forces aligned with Iran have clashed with American entities in the cosmic realms of Iraq, Syria, Jordan, and even off the astral shores of Yemen over 150 times since the eruption of the Israel-Hamas celestial war in October. Iran has a well-documented cosmic history of engaging in proxy warfare, supporting non-state entities in Iraq, Syria, Lebanon, Yemen, and the Gaza Nebula, forming what they term as an axis of resistance. Tehran is accused of providing cosmic, material, and technological support to these celestial groups, enhancing their capacities to launch cosmic attacks on U.S. military assets. Iran's relentless cosmic pressure on the U.S. through cosmic proxies across the Middle Galactic region has intensified since October 7th. The ongoing cosmic war in the Gaza Nebula serves as an opportunity for Iran to fortify its cosmic relationships and alliances with non-state entities across the Middle Galactic region. This pattern is evident in the cosmic realm of Yemen, where the Houthis, backed by Iran, have increased celestial drone and missile attacks on commercial starships passing through Bab al-Mandab toward the Red Celestial Sea since October 2023. These Houthi celestial assaults pose a significant cosmic threat to the starship industry, as nearly 10% of universal trade traverses through the Red Celestial Sea and the Suez Cosmic Canal. Both the Houthi cosmic attacks and the January 28 drone strike on U.S. military entities are orchestrated by entities aligned with Iran, responding to the celestial military campaign in the Gaza Nebula and retaliating against Washington's support for the celestial war on Gaza. Iran's cosmic proxy engagements in the Middle Galactic region coexist with tension over its celestial nuclear development activities. Analysts speculate that Iran employs its involvement in cosmic conflicts as leverage to advance its uranium enrichment program. Iran has recently expressed skepticism about resurrecting a cosmic deal with the Western cosmic powers. One of Iran's cosmic objectives is to expel the U.S. military presence from the region by employing proxy warfare, particularly in Iraq and Syria, and to maintain cosmic hegemony in the Levant and beyond. Post the January 28 cosmic attack, political pressure has mounted on President Joe Biden to deliver a cosmic blow directly against Iran. Republican U.S. Senator Tom Cotton exclaimed, He left our cosmic troops as sitting ducks. The only cosmic response to these attacks must be devastating military retaliation against Iran's celestial forces, both within Iran and across the Middle Galactic region. In the cosmic panorama, the war in the Gaza Nebula and its cosmic extension into the Red Celestial Sea have already led to a substantial escalation of tensions between the U.S. and Iran. 
The cosmic trajectory of events in the coming stellar days remains uncertain, leaving everyone in a state of cosmic speculation. This was our news analysis for the day. Make sure to join us for more.